Hey there guys, Pajama Prepper here, KC1CWP. Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to manually program a repeater into your Baofeng UV5R. I'm using the Repeater Book app on my iPhone 5. I will show you, uh, this will give me the information I need for the output frequency, the input frequency, the offset, and the PL tone. And then it also has the distance and everything else. So this is the repeater nearest me. I recommend when you're first programming the repeater, pick a repeater close to you, which most likely would be in range with the stock antenna, etc. So uh, we're going to go to the keypad here. We're going to type in the frequency of 1, 4, 7, 3, 3, 0. Sorry, that was off the screen for a minute. Now what we're going to do is go to menu over here, underneath the A and B button. Menu. And we're going to use the up arrow. And we're going to go to menu option T C T C S, which is the tone or the PL. <clears throat> okay, so the PL is already in there, but basically what you would do is use the up down arrows. It, it When you first get the radio, it will say off. And you can go like this, or you can just type it in. There we go. Okay, so just use the keypad, and it'll enter it, then hit menu again confirm. to confirm. Next, we're going to go up, and we're going to go to menu option SFT-D. This is menu option 25. This is the offset plus or minus. Using the up or down arrow, we will go from off to plus, uh, or if it's a negative offset, just go again until you get the minus sign. Confirm. Then I confirm. Now we're going to go up one option to menu option 26 and this is the offset frequency. Offset frequency. Thanks for acknowledging that. <laughs> and we're going to type in uh, basically what is 0.6 megahertz. So the way to do this on the Baofeng oh, is you're going to type this in as 0, 0, 6, 0, 0. Now if you did it differently like 0, 6, like you can see, it's very weird. You have to, it doesn't actually show where it is. Again, on the UV8HX, which is the other one I have, it actually goes to lines and you will know what you're entering in. So I don't even know where the six is going to be now. Okay. See, now it's just being stupid. So you got to be, there we go. <laughs> you got to pay attention to that. Confirm. We confirm. Okay. Offset frequency. There we go. Okay, and you can put in the memory if you want. And now what I'm going to do is hit the scan button once. This is also the reverse. As you can see, an R pops up at the top and the CT pops up there. It's showing me the transmit frequency. So if the output frequency and the input frequency match up with repeater book, as it does here, we see uh, 147330, Okay. 147330, 147930. This should, we should hear an acknowledgement when I transmit into this repeater. Just before you do, make sure to go back to where it shows the receiving frequency, because when you hit the push and talk button, KC1 CWP monitoring. When you push the uh, push the talk button, it will go and automatically go to where it was sh basically showing that frequency. <clears throat> so that's how you program a repeater manually into your Baofeng UV5R. If you have any questions, comments, etc., put them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. God bless America. Seven threes. Have a great day.